We do not say we, we say burden. We do not point with our fingers, nor do our fingers know where we are coming from, nor do we come from our fingers, nor do we gesture with the fist inside our mouths. We do not say we, we say other. Why and why and why should we call a transition a miracle? Does not every line guard what is in, yet provide mercy for the thing that is kept out? When a woman comes, may a woman come, and may we know her. May we know her by her desire to be a woman. May we know her by her desire, by the parts of her body, the parts of her body that say woman. May she have parts that say woman. May there be women who do not deceive us. May there be women who are not deceived. May we be women who are visible. May we show ourselves. May we be women. May we see ourselves. May we be visible. May we have ears. May we know them, may we know them, and may they see us. May there be women who do not kill themselves. May they call themselves women. May there be women who call themselves women. May there be allegiance, may there be enemy. May they be visible, may we see them. May there be women who call themselves women. May we see them. May there be women who call themselves men. May they see us, may we know them, and may we know them, and may they not kill us, and may we not thank them. May they be us, may they not thank us. May we not kill them, may they not kill them. May they call themselves women. May they not kill themselves. May they be thankful, and may they not kill us. May we not call them killers. May May they not be killers. May we not be killed. May they not be killed. May they be. May our eyes not fail us sometimes. May they be diligent. May they not blur the outlines. May there be outlines, lines that tell us where the diligent live. May our eyes be diligent. Tell us who is out, what is out, who is in. May our eyes tell us who is out, and may they come in. May we know them. May we see them. May we see them. May we welcome them. May they be visible. May there be inside, and may we be inside. And may the inside be visible to what is outside. May it be visible to what is in. May it reveal us. May it conceal us, and may we be in. We do not say we, we say burden. May the hands not know any burden. May the hands not know any hands. The hands know so many burdens. The hands that we do not yet know. May these hands not always be men's hands. May these hands not always be my hands. May these hands not always be burdens. May they be my hands. May they freeze me. May they not touch me. May they scald me. May they open me. May they touch me. May they open me. May they not own me. May they not touch you. Men's hands are always touching you. May you not yet touch me. May you touch me. May you touch me in places I cannot yet see. May there be a self, and may it be woman, and may it be plenty. May she show herself by what she loosens with her teeth. When a death occurs, it is not your death. You do not know this instinctually. The death is outside of you. You are in a dark hole and someone is outside of you. Someone outside of you is near you and what is near you is in a dark hole. What is in a dark hole is near you and you are someone outside and near you. You are outside and you are near you and you are dead. Yesterday it was 28. Today it's 29, tomorrow it'll be 30. I won't be able to remember how to get to the Transgender Day of Remembrance Memorial page for weeks. The year is already over and still it is 2010. This is the same year as last year and the same as the year before that. Yesterday it was 143, today it is 31. Chances are any one of them could have lived in Tucson. Although it is unrealistic to say that any one of them could be me, I say it anyway. I say that the women who were stabbed with sharp objects in their own homes were women who looked out their windows before they were women stabbed with sharp objects in their own homes. I say that the electrical cord will continue to be a weapon long after it was used on her throat. I say that the women with bruises on their palms were women with voices before they were women identified by the bruises on their palms. I say that the women strangled with scarves were women with scarves. I say that the women who were beaten with bricks were women with bones. I say that the women who were drowned were women who talked. 
I say that the women whose homes were set on fire were women with homes. I say that the women who were run over by cars were women who walked. I say that the women who were stabbed in the neck were women who knew they were being stabbed in the neck. I say that the women without names were women with names. I say that the women who were found in the dumpster, I say that the women who were shot with an automatic rifle, I say that the women who were gang raped, I say that the women whose heads were shaved and their videos were shown on the internet, I say that the women who were executed, I say that the women who were found naked in the street, I say that they were women. I say that they were women. And I say that the, woman, the ones with sharp objects, with electrical cords, with scarves, with fires, with hands, with cars, with knives, with shoulders, with rifles, with razors, with clothes, were men. They were men. They were me. We have been told that with the invention of the video, death is no longer absolute. We've been told that we should feel lucky. We've been told that working memory is five to nine objects, 60 to 90 seconds. We've been told that there were no witnesses. We've been told that there were no subjects, suspects. This is the shape of what we are missing. 6'3", brown skin, green eyes, brown hair. Hands large enough to protect the face from the first swing, shoulders and calves full of muscle misplaced, Long nails, delicate, a large thing, asserting its wish to be small. We press record when what we want is to listen. We press play when what we want is to forget. The eight-year-old asleep under her mother's desk in the morning. You are in a dark hole, strangled with an electrical cord, shot. Burned and found next to her packed luggage, shot. Wounds and defensive bruises, partially clothed, shot. A bruise, shot. In the open palm of the left hand, shot. Someone is near you, shot. 17 times, shot. Stabbed in the chest, shot. In the dump, in the street, shot. In her home, shot. Shot, shot, shot. Beheaded, shot, shot. A mile away from her body, shot raped, shot, raped, shot, and then raped, shot, and then raped, shot, at close range, shot. You depend on the possibility that what follows exquisite fear exists entirely outside of you and without meaning. You depend on the nearness of what is not yet outside of you, the nearness of outside the nearness of not yet. <clears throat>